32 RBIs. And she's going to take off for second, and the throw is not in time. Chelsea Manto with her 20th stolen base on the circle for the Hofstra Pride or for the Charleston Cougars. Beg your pardon, is and facing a tough task. The ball's going to get away, and the throw not in time as the short. It's going to be shot toward the shortstop, Giordano. It's going to be a tough play in time. What a stretch at first base. Wow. By Angelina I. Apollo. Wow. Angel. It's going to be a base hit through the 4 3 hole, and Hofstra will play it another run. Just mentioned she had 30 hits, give her 31, and bring her up her RBI tally to five. And runs one of those earlier today. It's going to be back up the middle. Lemire will fill it easily, fire it a first in time. So we might have some. Frequency. And you know it's a good restaurant when peach cobbler or a dessert is a is labeled as a vegetable. Absolutely. And it's going to be a long throw, not in time, as Natalie Windham, a hard hit ball, is going to beat it out at first base. Wind is at a slight breeze. It's going to be a bounce to short, tagging at third and firing to first. What a solo effort by Megan Giordano, turning to. Wow. Two hits on the night for the Cougars will step in, and this is a drive in a right center field. This is going to get down potentially for extra bases. It's going to bounce up against the wall. And Peyton Wade, a one-woman show right now. Two of the three hits. This one goes for extra bases. 2-2 Two -two from Mullen. It's going to be grounded through the 5-6 hole. It's going to get through. They're going to test the arm of McKevitt. And it's not in time. Kellyanne Carter will score, and Noel Dominguez comes through again. Just a fantastic. Tracy Lynch as that ball is going to get bunted down. It's going to be a tough play, and it's going to fall for a hit. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a master class in how to lay down the perfect deadened. The 1-0 is going to be bunted in the air. It's going to be caught. What a play. Oh, Peyton Wade sliding in. Switched back. And it's going to be a shot to left field, and another diving play by the College of Charleston. Oh my goodness! I. It's gonna be a shot back up the middle. It's gonna be a tough play, and oh my goodness again! This time, claim responsibility for just the prowess of these athletes. That's gonna be a shot in the left center field gap, and this is Iopolo. Iopolo chugging into second. She'll slide in safely with an extra base hit. Three one. We bounce back up the middle. That's going to be a base hit. They're going to hold Iopolo at third. She said you get maybe three reps a day. And that's going to be a shot back to the shortstop and another web jam, and that's going to... Imagine that. Cheering on his mom. That was her husband as well. And that's a shot down the left field line by Mia Ditto. It's a fair ball. Rounding first, heading for second. Stand-up double for Mia Ditto, and Charleston has got something cooking. The 2-2, two -two. high goes into the screen. Mia Ditto coming home, and she is safe. The wild pitch by Pisapia scores Ditto. The weather, it's going to be a shot toward third base. Dominguez can't come up with it, but that was a rocket from Wilson. Run in the fourth. It's going to be hit back up the middle. Carter's going to scoop it and go to second to get the lead runner. The sting like a beetle, and there it goes. You are a wizard, Colby Cook. Indeed. And so. That was brilliant. Off speed pitch, gonna be granted to Jenna Carter. It's gonna be a tough play. Bobbles fires to first, not in time. So Sam. It's gonna be a shot to Anise Roman. Oh, what a play. A game saving play by. One mistake in the bottom frame, and it's over. That's gonna be a flare over the shortstop's head, and it's down. Just scream and hit me, then just drops off the table. And that's going to be a base hit over the head of Sam Ward. Well, that fastball. But with time and talent, that's going to help. And that's going to be a base hit laced. In the it's going to be dribbled back to Peyton Lemire. Going to have to show the athleticism. And she does. And she's out at first base. Bunt single. Again, that's a good bunt. Ball dies. And it looks like that ball just got over her glove and nicked her right in the head. During the commotion, Dominguez. It's 
going to be a base hit through the 5-6 hole. And Anise Roman's going to try and score, and yes, she will. Advancing on the throw is Carter and Helberg. And there is the insurance run that the Cougars... ...in there as long as possible, but not to be. That's going to get down for a base hit, and it's going to be extra bases. Charleston got the insurance run, and they're going to get more. Going for third, the throw is not in time, and the ball gets away. She'll stop at third, but Charleston could only manage two runs in seven, but now they got four runs. Lemire's pitch back up the middle. It's going to get through for a base hit. They're going to hold Iapolo. Wade will cut it off. The second payoff. It's going to be hit deep towards right center field. It is going back. It is going back, and it's gone. Hofstra has life. And McKevitt, who had been kept quiet all night long, was 0 for 4, brings Hofstra within a run. And she just slammed on the plate. And saving Charleston's season. The 2-2 two -two and Devin Lasco swinging a miss. And this game is over. Wow. Carl what a 